Why? Because the police know there's fucking consequences. Consequences, bro. Fuck all that, that Bible. Consequences. No, 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 Look, well, you came over across the right room. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come back, come back, come back. Right? I, I got, I, damn, I left my phone at home. I got a video, just, bro. I'm talking about an army of my people. Right? Let me tell you something, man. Go ahead. You see these motherfucking, uh, 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 motorcycle gangsters all up around the state, bro. Mm -hmm. You see them motherfuckers that can't for some shit, bro? Mm -hmm. And these niggas don't know it, man. You see them walking around being stupid and shit. Them motherfuckers is the pain, hey, bro. Look at these motherfucking motorcycle clubs all up and down this mother, all up and down this motherfucking shit. There's a motorcycle club down here, bro. Are you having a little party? Once or twice a year, please don't fuck with them. There be so many motherfucking motorcycles down there, and then it, I don't know if y'all do TikTok. TikTok, it be motherfuckers on there threatening. They be throwing out their motherfucking back. Well, I'm going to tell you this, brother. We we walking with the most high God. That's right. Right? right. right? No, no, no weapon formed against us is ever going to prosper. That's, That's right. right. Hey, you know something? That's how I go through life now. But I want to be prepared. Yeah. Listen, and a part of being prepared is being a part of a body. Right? That's right. A body of what? A body of, 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 of fellow-minded brothers. Right? Brothers that, brothers that, A, the most important part is brothers that is guided, by the law, statutes, and commandments, right? Because the law, statutes, and commandments, right? When we read them, they tell me I cannot stand idly by the blood of my neighbor. Meaning, if I see one of the motorcycles, one of the motorcycle gang members, right, doing something to you, guess what I got? Do? I can't stand. I can't stand idly by and watch you, right? And look, speaking of the devil, right? So the first thing with the bullet, one of the laws tell me I cannot stand idly by the blood of my neighbor. So if one of these motorcycle people do something to you, right, and I'm there, I have an obligation to God to protect my brother, right? Yeah. And think about if, if blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans did that as a collective. But George Floyd would still be alive. That's George right. George Floyd would still be alive. Marcellus, what can you call it? Marcellus, would still be yeah. alive. Bro, we don't, we don't, I, I know, we don't stand together. And I'm the crazy part is the prosecutor told him, like, nah, he didn't do it. We don't oh. even got enough. <laughs> the my DNA said he did. My man should be charged. The governor needs to be charged with fucking murder. I'm going to be honest with you, bro. I got, I, got, I, got, I, got, I, got, I got air prints, right? You know why the police don't be over the one killing them? You know why? Because they're not God's chosen people. Because they're not, cause they're not under the curses. Hold on, let me let me tell you something. I don't, I don't. Now, when y'all when y'all quote me scriptures from the Bible, I'm gonna be honest with you. My brother, I walk through life. I got a personal relationship with a higher power. I don't care what's in that. It don't make me no difference. I have a relationship with a higher power, in which none of y'all understand or believe, right? But it's it's true. You have to have walked in these shoes to understand where I'm coming from. This shit is true, right? Now, you say they don't be shooting down the little. Uh, teenagers in Dearborn, young Arab guys, right? Oh. And you say you don't know why? I, I do not know why. You say because they're not cursed. They're not God's people. Okay, listen. Uh, listen. I don't believe in that curse. Why curse us? I ain't did nothing to God, right? God's supposed to be. He knows everything about everything. Everything here is His, right? Why would He curse me for some stuff that it's happened? Obedience. Million. I ain't just. So, I wasn't disobedient. I didn't have time for it. This happened before I was born. Now, going back to the reason that they don't feel, you know, that the young men in their born, listen, listen, I'm going to tell you exactly why. I'm going to tell you exactly why. Because the police know there's fucking consequences. Consequences, bro. Fuck all that, that Bible consequences. Now, hold on. Now, hold on. Now, hold on. Here's the problem. Here's the problem. Hold on, hold on. You know, now, one thing is, you know, you, you don't got to believe in the book, right? But once we get to, once we get to fuck the book, right? When this book... I didn't say no, fuck the book. Look, I said I'm not, just not into that. I don't, you just said I, it. 
Yeah, I, I ain't mean to do that. That's why you walk over here, bro. I don't mean no harm, man. But listen, yeah, I couldn't listen. tell. But look, yeah, no, 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 like I was just telling you, bro, when we, this book is the reason that we are not bad in a better predicament that we're in right now because our people do not pick up this book and read it for what it is. They go to Sunday and they sit down and they let somebody read one verse and steal their money from them. Exactly. So what we cannot do is we cannot take the frustration with religion out on the book because the book didn't do it. Listen, you know, you know something? This, this book is like any other book. People, I've been watching these black people go to church every day for their whole life, right? You can master that book. Once you graduate, once you get all the knowledge from that book, you don't have to go to church. No, no I'm going to tell you, there you is put, no, you put it, it comes from the heart. And there you is no graduating this from work. this book. This you book has been around, that. this book has been around for millennia. And, you can graduate and, and, from that book, This bro. book has been around for millennia and, and the masses of people still don't even understand the basics. You can they still think that, Adam and Eve. Me, they, they still think uh, talking a snake talked to Eve and deceived let, her to let, eat let, fruit. Let, 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 yeah. let me hit you with some real knowledge, bro. Listen, life ain't complicated. God ain't complicated. Ain't nothing complicated. Man make it so. That book ain't complicated, bro. Hey, I, know, I, I know it ain't. It's not complicated at all. I know it ain't, but see what, 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 what complicated out is when people start to lie to it. Check out the spelling. Good, God, devil, evil. Understand that, bro. That book ain't complicated. Life ain't complicated. Man makes it complicated. Hold, hold on, bro. Come, come back. Come back. We, we have, we have a conversation, bro. Bro, you got, you got a couple more minutes, man. For God, man. Hold on, man. No, you, you all got me all on camera, man. You gonna get me in trouble, man. I, I want to be under the radar, bro. We talking about these motherfuckers in the neighborhood. And, and this is this on this, the real well, time. What you want to be covert? We got, we got a First Amendment right. We got the freedom of speech. Go ahead, go ahead. You got the freedom of speech. Hold on, how did my hair look, man? <laughs> Hell no. Huh? How did my hair look, bro? Fabulous, King, fabulous. You're doing your damn thing with the hair. We, we like that, we like that for you. All right, hey, listen, but, but listen, who are the brothers that be wearing the little, the little, the, what you call it down there? Y'all look, you're looking at us. you looking at us. Hold on, y'all be up on sale, man. Why don't be knowing about that? Why y'all don't get no airplane, man? Well, my motherfucker gonna come do nothing for us, bro. It's thousands of y'all. I was ready to lead a fucking job. Come join y'all. Because you know who, because you know who gonna do something for us, is the guy of this book that you keep on about. You can graduate from. Uh, uh, he he's gonna do something for us, right? I'm, I'm let, let, let me tell you, God. Let me tell. Let me tell you. Break. You been you watch news. You been paying attention to the Middle know. East. You been paying attention to Russia. Well, I'm here to tell you that that America is getting ready to be blown off the map right. by you know Russia. Them? You know why that's gonna happen? Give me go back to Ezekiel 38 and 4. This is why I say this book ain't like any other book, because this book got prophecy. This is the most historically reliable, historically accurate my book on the face of the planet Earth. This book is not like any other book. This book has no mate, right? Because God is talking to it. And this is why this is why it's not the same. Go ahead. This is the book of Ezekiel chapter 38 and verse 4. Bring it out. Ezekiel chapter 38 and verse 4. Bring it out. And I will turn thee back and put hooks into thy jaws, and I will bring thee forth and all thine army, horses and horsemen, all of them clothed with all sorts of armor. So God said he's going to take Russia and her allies and draw them to the fight. Right? So Russia ain't even in control in charge of what she's doing. God is in control. And the reason that God's gonna have Russia blow America off the map is for what she's done to so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Uh, so the same way God dang, man, the, sa down. the same way that you said, right? Because you said something earlier. The same way you said the governor needs to be charged. He's not gonna be charged. Why well, give Zechariah eleven five? This is the book of Zechariah, chapter eleven, verse five. Whose possessor slave them? and hold themselves not guilty. Right, say our possessors, those who oppress us, those who own us and oppress us, right, the so-called white man, right, say they slay us and hold themselves not guilty. So they're not gonna ever hold themselves accountable, but God is. Like I was just explaining to him, God is building a RICO case on, on the white people and all these other nations that's mistreated so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. And the ultimate judgment for that is blowing this place off the Let me ask you something though, bro. Why do you Ancestors have to spend the whole life 
and slack. I'm concerned with that. That's what I do for a living, man. I, I fix them fire trucks and ambulances for a living. This is the book of Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 15. Let's go answer know. your question. But it shall come to pass, if thou will not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. So it said, if we don't keep God's law, statutes, and commandments, then all these curses are going to happen. Verse 68. Uh, uh, but why only to us? Verse 68. Because we're the only people that God gave instructions to. That, that's why when you said, why don't they go to Dearborn? I said, because they're not God's people. No. Right? God did So you got kids. No. No. When a, when, when a father, when a father, like you, kids be playing down the street, you may have told your, you may have told your kid, hey, look, don't you cross the street, oh, no, right? I'm, 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 listen, I, 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 take, I treat them all like they're my kids. I don't have them. I know, but I, I tell just, them just like they're my kids. I talk to them like they're my kids. Don't do this, don't do that. Hey, man, you screwing up. Come here, let me talk to you. you know yeah, but you're going to talk to them, right? Yeah. But if your kid, if you tell, if you give your kid instructions, don't cross that street, and all their friends cross the street, so they want to be with their friends and they cross the street, you're going to whoop your kid. You're not gonna whoop the neighbor's kid, cause now, now you got conflict. So it's the same way. God gave us instruction. It don't matter what everybody else on the outside do, cause he's not their God. He's our God. So whatever we, whatever he tell us to do, we're held to that standard. That's why we're the only ones that get punished for not living a godly lifestyle. Now you know I, I, I know I got a hard time. With, with verse 68. That. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. With ships. So it said the Lord will bring us into Egypt again with ships. You familiar with Moses? Mm -hmm. Go to Pharaoh, tell him, let my people go. Uh -huh. We just walked out of Egypt. Right? So he said, I'll bring you back into Egypt. Right? And the word Egypt, Ma Ma Mitraim or Matizarium in the Hebrew, means between a rock and a hard place or between yeah. two rocks. Let me ask you something. Let me ask you something, bro. I, 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 I can get down with you if you could prove to me one thing. What? A burial site. Is anybody mentioned in that book? You know why you don't got a burial site? Uh, hold on. Listen, no, let's listen, hold on. Listen, hold on. Whatever come out your mouth. Give me. Pull up the I Jerusalem necropolis. Me, pull up the Jerusalem necropolis. I can't. Whatever pull up the come Jerusalem out your necropolis. Mouth, a person can't prove that. Look up the Jerusalem necropolis. The really? reason. The reason that we don't have burials. The reason you don't have like tombs with mummies in them is because we don't worship the dead. The, the burial customs of, of the Israelites is once they die, you get them in the ground as soon as possible. Once the body decomposes, you go back, grab the bones, and you put them in, in the family tomb. The so family it's not tombs? the Jerusalem necropolis. Where's the family tomb? Look at this right here. I never Look at this right here. That's the Jerusalem necropolis. That's so where the that's where they that's in. where they got the bones. You're not gonna find that's why I keep saying you're not gonna find a body from three thousand years ago. We didn't mummify it. We bear once once the body decomposed into bones, we, we grab them and we put them in a box. So you're gonna find a bunch of bones. Now, if you ask whose bones is whose, we don't have an ancient Israelites hey, DNA sample. Like, oh, this is Moses. If someone died in me, you know what? When I died, you know what I told my people to do? What? To burn me up, drill a hole in a tree, and pour my remains down there. Yeah, I know what that is. Yeah, I know what that is. That's going to help your, your tree grow. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I've seen that before. That's gonna be, and the people going to wonder, this is the best looking tree I've ever seen in my life. I know I sound crazy to y'all, well, but I'm in the world all by myself, though, bro. It's 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 because of the beautiful hair. That's why the tree got grow like that. Hold on, hold on. So did that answer your question? No, no, listen, listen, listen. And man, I was just why I took the army. I ain't joking, man. I want to be with the army, man. Man, listen. Listen, oh, you said you left your phone. Where y'all meet up at, man? Where y'all meet up at? Is it any place I can come to? You know, we be here. We be uh, we got a spot on the east side, baby. But you don't got your phone. I'm, I left my phone at yeah. home, man. I left my phone at home, bro. Man, that works. That works. Man, I, I, I just be so busy out here working for the white man, man. They be hiding my phone that he do plays type of stuff. Hey, what you say? Hey, hold, on, hold on, what you say? Say it again. Hold on, what you say? Say it again. What you say? I messed up. What did I say? <laughs> what you what say? You, what did I say? Uh, you said you said you, you said you be busy. I said like. With the white man doing what? No, no, you said they got you on your what? On I your... Got, no, I said they be having me working like. No, there you, you said go. you be on your what? There you go. And you know why they working like that? There you go. Because your black ass is a Hebrew slave. That's right. <laughs> and look, why he getting you? Look, why he getting you this information? Okay, okay, Deuteronomy twenty-eight sixty-eight. 
Hey, listen. <laughs> That's what life is about, bro. You wake up and you learn something like that. Hey, listen. Life is the most prestigious college you can go to. Hey, listen. For sure, for sure. Uh, Hey, you said you saw the signs. Let me let me ask you about this sign right here. Excuse me, sir. You said you looked at the sign. I want to know about what you feel about this one right here. Where is alligator? Right here. Right here. What 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 you think about this one? This one right here. What you think about this? You know what that is? You know what it is? You know what it is? Hey, don't say that, man. I know what it appears to be. What does it appear to be? Black children and alligator bait. That's to me. That's horrible. That's when they took little black babies, right? And they fed them to alligators. That's when they took little black babies and they fed them to alligators, so that. Uh, colonial America to walk around with their gator skin shoes and their gator skin bags. It, it all happened at the at the death of little black babies. That's how does that make you feel? What so what do you think should be done? How do we rectify that situation? Do you believe in God? To a certain extent, yes. yes. Not, I'm not, I know very little bit about the Bible. Very little about the Lord. That's fucking disgusting. You guys have a good day. Hey, bro, hey, bro. I'm going to go to that. You're going the wrong way. <laughs> 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 we on TikTok, but hey, man. Just go on the YouTube. We there. Put me in work. Spirit of the wrong side. Right. But why y'all? I mean, y'all got to vote, still, man. Deuteronomy 17. Why we got to vote? We've been vote. How long well, we been vote? Listen, listen, listen. This woman, right? Uh, who? She's running for office, right? She is also desperately needed in the black community. There's nothing more than a role model. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why do we need this white woman in the black community as a role model to little what, black girls? What white woman? Kamala Harris. She's white. She's white. Yes, she is. Uh -oh. Hold on. You know her great. You know her great 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 grandfather was one of was the biggest slave owner in all of Jamaica. You know that, right? Well, that's the that's going on with me too. That can go on with me too. But look at me. Oh hell no. <laughs> listen. Oh, listen. Hell no. Hold on. No, no, no. With me too. no, listen. So hard. Now that begs the question from you, are you the descendant of a slave or are you the descendant of a slave owner? But see, here's the thing, right? Because slave owners, they can trace their lineage, but they can tell you, oh, we, I come from the, the great Swarthian house in, in England, right? You ask a nigga where he go back to, man, he, a, a, a plantation somewhere in Georgia. Georgia. Right? So do you descend from a slave or do you descend from a slave owner? I'm going to my black. I mean, look at Bob Marley. Look at Bob Marley. Bob Marley is real black. Man, he's a white man. His father is white, right? You got uh, Diana Ross kids, both of them. Tracy Ellis and uh, Evan, the, the little boy from ATL. Little, big little brother, that one. He, he's white. They, Diana Ross, all her kids is white, but they got melanin. But it's also about what Barry Gordy is white. How you feel? It's not about how you feel. It's about I'm gonna show you number one and eighteen. Okay. And listen, Rachel, Rachel Dolezal, Rachel Dolezal is both black than Kamala is, and she's still a white woman. You see what I'm saying? So why do we need her in a community to show black people how to be black? Do you know what she did? Do you know how she swindled the black people? She said, "Oh, my friend Quavo would say," and then she had Megan Thee Stallion twerking at the Democratic now, National now, Convention. Now that I didn't like, but you that's, know, that's but that's how she feels about you. She feels that your women ain't good for nothing more than taking their ass for a phone. That's how she looks at black women. Listen, listen, did that eat? 
why did she have Megan Thee Stallion on a black woman shaking ass at the Democratic I, I, Convention? I couldn't explain that, but you know something? I, I give her the benefit. Because that's how she you know, looks at I give black her the benefit of the doubt. Sometimes in life, I make mistakes. And if you didn't know me, you would have assumed that this was my intention. You know, matter of fact, you know how she got into the national spotlight? On the arm of Montel Williams. She was on the arm of Montel Williams. And then became California State Prosecutor locking up so many black now, Hispanic on, no, men. No, 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 un, you go, un, you unjustly. Hold on. Now, do you know that real story about when she was the prosecutor? Yeah, how she, she locked, locked up black Hispanic men unjustly. Well, listen, listen, do you know what her re-entry program was about? See, let me explain something. That's a bad woman, bro. And she, That's went, a against, bad woman. And she went against Michael. But Michael who? Jackson. Jackson. Up here when? When he went through the 2005 the trial molestation case, which, by the way, the FBI released all files and said we found nothing on this man. Okay, but me, and she me, tried me, to put me, a black man away. Let, 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 hold on, let me let me say this, bro. Let, let the, that without the, without the <laughs> seeing past the first stone. So in other words, I don't lie, I don't lie, I don't, listen, I don't listen, unjustly lock black people up so I can speak on it. Now, uh -huh. listen, listen, is that the absolute? Listen, truth? listen, yes, uh, yes. So remember, listen, remember listen, in the early two thousands, all the rappers was trying to get to Trump Towers to have a ball. Trump was in all the black rappers' music videos. Everybody do. wanted to beat Trump. Okay. He became he became president. All of a sudden, he's racist, and this is by no way an endorsement for Donald Trump. But what I'm saying is, one was better with niggas than the other one. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> one was better for niggas. for the for the black people. Right? Are you familiar with the platinum plan? You remember the platinum plan Trump was trying to trying to uh, I, 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 well, implement? Well, once I, I I do like this. I put Trump in a category, and he's gonna stay in that category. That's a wicked man. That's a wicked man. Kamala Harris is a wicked woman. I, and listen, I, I, tell you I don't what, even I, got a dog. I, that's I, like, I'll say you're a wicked man. I, I tell you what. When I address you, I did it for one reason because you proved it to me. You absolutely proved it to me, and I got facts. You see what I'm saying? Until then, bro. I let you. I, I let you do your thing. So what? But fact? when you prove it to me, when you prove it to me that you're a screwed up individual, I will not. It's not going nowhere. So, so what, is, what, what has why? Kamala proved to you? What has she proved? To you? Listen. Then that's a smart woman. <laughs> what she do? Yeah. How she, what? she proved that to you? Listen, listen, just what has she done for the past history. four years? Her, her schooling. First of all, if she the vice president, now you gotta know this. Vice president ain't got no call to do nothing, bro. She, she <laughs> the president don't the president don't know how to get off the stage. Who got the power in? Listen, listen. Right now he can't she, put a sentence together. Who got the power in? That, she, she can't. No, I'm talking about the president now, but after current president Joe Biden. You talking Joe Biden stepped down? She's she's. So she's, so she's the president. But, but so listen, what has she done on, but, but in the listen, past four years? I'm going to be honest with you, man. You, Mr. White, the, the media is in control of everything we hear, bro. They really in control, right? And if you don't... Listen, they asked her what she's going to do for black people, and she said she's not going to do I jack shit for this uh, But I tell you what. But. I tell you what. But. I tell you what. I'm smart enough to know this. But she did not say within the first year, within say, the first year that she was that they I, 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 under their presidency, when, when, there was a stop Asian. Hey, there was something for just Asians. But when you ask her about doing something for just blacks, she can't do it. But I'll tell you, oh, that's I, right. I tell you and what, not I only that, what. she further disrespected your intelligence by telling you, you know, I make good collard greens. The same way Hillary Clinton told you she don't ever leave home without a bottle of hot sauce in well, the purse. Well, you know something? Talk like that don't bother me, man. I swear to God, it don't but bother don't, me. That's the kind of shit that should bother that's you because listen, this is how low of you that they think. That's they right. think, they think, what. they think you are no better listen. than a chitlin eating nigga. Teach, huh? That's all they think you is is a <laughs> chitlin eating nigga. But you know, listen, I but love collard greens as much as, as much as the next but Negro. You know what? But what you're not gonna do is you're not gonna get on an interview and tell me that I know how to make good collard greens and that's supposed to make me flock to the polls for you. No, that don't bother That's me. that's insulting that my intelligence. Me. It's Which, insulting my listen, intelligence when you want my vote so you go get Megan Thee Stallion and her goons to start insult, shaking ass at the Democratic convention. Teach, huh? When you outright personally come at me. I'd that's rather have an enemy that's honest than a than an enemy that acts like a friend in your face. At least uh, I know right. where I stand I, with I, Donald I, I, Trump. That's I, right. I don't want nobody that act okay. friendly in a, my a, face a and then turn around and say, "Nigger." A convicted right. rapist, a com this and that, thirty some felony offenses, and you just because now you know where he stands, you know what he's about. You you would have his back if you did, Paul. Bro, that's ludicrous. I know. I didn't. I told you I'm in no way endorsing. 
Donald J. Trump is president. Well, I tell you what. I know he gave niggas money. He freed Kodak. He freed Wayne. Damn it, he freed Kwame. Oh, okay. You know what? He freed Kwame, man. Look what he did. He let Kwame out of jail, right? And Wayne and Kodak. Listen, and he didn't get Kwame the full pardon, bro. I understand that. He didn't get the full Kwame still owed the money. Listen, he gave him, I forget the name of it. He let him out of jail, said, but you still owe the five, six, seven, ten million dollars. No, that's restitution. Bro, that's, that's no, restitution. No, 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 no. It's, listen, it's two parties, bro. You get a full party and a partial party. He gave Kwame a partial party. Bro. Hey, did, but did he let bro. Kwame out? Bro, man, but then he let I'm Kwame a, out. But he showed Trump so he let Kwame is, out, and if it was up to Kamala Harris, he'd be case. right back in. Uh, you can't say that. You cannot say Listen, that. Listen, it's her track record. You cannot say that. It's, bro, it's her, what, as a again, prosecutor again, in the state of California, her, her, it's her track record. Listen, that's right. Don't nobody do this. Her re-entry program for brothers getting out of prison was the best. They and wouldn't have to re-enter if she never took him out in the first place. But if you did some research. She locked up. Listen, that's, you're that's, saying, that's, you're saying, you're where saying. You, where you getting your information listen, from? Listen, he put the crab, she put the crab in the bucket, <laughs> and then she took the bucket to the ocean. No, 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 And then she no. just put the a no. bucket in the ocean and let the crab out. Listen. She shouldn't have put the crab in the bucket listen. in the first place. I for the but For the crab to need to be reintroduced some, to listen. its natural environment. Do some in-depth research. She locked up less black men than people of, of less power than her, bro. I'm, listen, I'm, I can go in depth with what I know. I ain't got my, I ain't got my phone here and this and that and this and that, bro. I'm, can, I listen, can somebody I pull like up? This. Can somebody pull up Kamala Harris's uh, track record as the press, California state prosecutor? You know something? You know something? No, I gotta go. I gotta go, man. It was a pleasure, <laughs> bro. I'm be seeing y'all, man. And listen, I'm be seeing y'all. You know what? Uh, but, but for real though, you know why we not gonna vote? We already, we already got our ruling. I, 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 we yeah. already got our ruling. No, I feel you. Hey, yeah. but brother, you know something? I got, I got to vote for. I got seven sisters and I love them, man. I got their back, just like I got all y'all back. I got their back. So let me ask you this: Do you? She's good complexion. So let me ask you this: So do you believe, right, in Kamala Harris's stance on abortion? Well, I, be, I believe that you know. Want me to tell you what I believe? Whatever a person do, you the one got to deal with the higher power that you're talking about. That's the way I see that. I'm bro. just asking: Do you, you believe? So, so you talking about going to the polls and voting for Kamala? Do you believe? So, that, do you do you believe in her stance on listen, abortion? Trump's stance was the one that got Marcellus Williams killed with the people that he put in the Supreme Court. Understand so, that. ask him about Kevin Cooper. Understand that. that. Understand that. He, so what about Kevin Trump's, Cooper? Trump's decision. Got him killed. We just had another brother that was just hung by a tree with three weeks ago. But you, 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 you try to go to the goalpost real quick. Just I uh, do so. Do you agree with all Kamala Harris's stance on abortion? I don't care. Because why we? Because why we talking about? Because why we sit here talking about it? Right? More than her. More than her uh, uh, track record as no. California State Prosecutor. Here's a fact. More so-called black people die at Planned Parenthood than to gun violence and diseases. No, that's that Planned Parenthood. That was that was some 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 stuff. It was a trick. It was a trick, bro. My point exactly. Genocide. That's why I'm Genocide. asking you. Do you do you agree with her stance that you should be able to just go kill babies because you don't like the nigga you lay down with? Right. I'm be, I'm that's no, what they're. I'm, that, be, I'm be honest with you. I ain't got nothing to say about what a woman do with her body. She got to deal with the higher power when she leaves here. That's the way I look at it, bro. I ain't got nothing to do with it. But so I, you I thought you was pro black. Hold on, listen, I, I am. More black people die from abortions than gun violence what? and I'll diseases. That's the most black. Okay. Listen, so the who, most who dangerous be, place. Who need to be talking the about most. These, these women and men sitting down having these babies, bro. You my need to catch them before my, they get to the bed. My point exactly. Catch them before my point, they get to the my bed, point exactly. Abortion I, is is the is the way that they try to just erase their responsibility. Bro, and Kamala Harris wants you to just go kill more black babies because you feel like it. Not be not not for a serious health cause. It you know is. Who gets more abortions than anybody? Our people need to be reprogrammed, bro. And that you know what the program you know what we need to reprogram with the laws of God. 
That's what they need to be programmed with because the laws of God will tell you you're not going to just kill babies. That's what they did. In, that's what they did in Egypt. That's what they did when Christ was born. The Romans. That's what they do. They always go after black babies. Why? And we always wonder why we don't got the next revolutionary or the next leader. It's because they somewhere in the goddamn dumpster because white people keep making it seem like the morally acceptable thing to do to avoid uh, responsibilities. Well, I'm gonna go ahead. You know what I mean? It was a pleasure, fella. It was a, a real present. I got y'all's number, man. I'm going to find time out there. I ain't going to say that no more. Getting away from the job. <laughs> and I'm going to give it to you. So, I can't really read it because all that stuff I'm finding about Kamala is that she just fraud. She just fraud, dog. Like, you really got to do your deep dive research no, no, on it. She's, she's, on, she's locked up a lot of people she, unjustly. A lot of brothers, a lot of sisters, all that. Oh, I have one right here. Listen, but you know what? You got two stories. ABC News. Listen, you'll you be, you be having two stories, though. You have your truth, my truth, and... The no, truth. but here's the problem. You just said, I don't care what she does. Which I, no, no, no. I didn't say... I, I, I just... I, on, on the abortion. It's on, on, the abortion it's on tape. Thing. On the abortion thing. Well, so why don't you... People that's pro-black need to care about killing babies. Killing little black babies. Well, half the people that's acting like they care... Old white men, they don't give a crap about what they're doing. They just want a Republican in office. That's all they want. Okay, that, and, they okay. go, and they go on with... So this is from, this from Newsweek. Conservatives opposed to Kamala Harris are focusing on her role as a former prosecutor and a California attorney general, especially the case of a man on death row for murdering four people and her stance on marijuana. What kind of four people? Harris denies any wrongdoing in the case of Kevin Cooper, a black man convicted in California of murdering four white people in 1983 and sentenced to death. He has maintained his innocence but lost at least a dozen appeals. He remains on death row in San Quentin, the state prison. Okay, now, now that Harris has entered the presidential race as the presumptive replacement for President Joe Biden, pro-Trump commenters are highlighting her role in the Cooper case. So mm, that's that. that okay, so, hold on, that's very that's very similar to okay, the Marcellus so, case, so, isn't so, it? So, the one that you put on Trump. Okay, listen, listen, right? listen. Now that she's the president, maybe she can reevaluate this. Oh, well, maybe if if maybe. I, um, I, I put it to you this way. I, I thought did, I, I thought you only went on things. You, I thought you only stood on things you could prove. But no, I gotta go with this. I don't. What he's reading is that factual. I don't believe this. this is like what they say. Come on, come, right? come on. But then, and this, and this is the thing about the political conversation that's so funny to me. Trump can pump fake all this and all this, but nobody else is capable of doing it. Right, we no, no, so no, we no, just no. got to think. We just got to take everything Trump says a lie, and then sit around and say, "No, Kamala Harris isn't like that. He she suffers. she's pulling a Rachel Dolezal all on y'all." That man suffering from Alzheimer's right now. He don't know what. This is the story. Of, you got confused with Biden. This is the story of a broken justice system. It appears that an innocent man was framed by sheriff's deputies and is on death row in part because of dishonest cops, sensational media coverage, and four political leaders, including Democrats like Brown and Kamala Harris the state attorney general, before becoming a U.S. senator who refused to allow newly available DNA testing for a black man convicted of hacking to death a beautiful white family and young neighbor, Christoph Ledge. Who is, who is, who is, who is, what's this guy's name? What's his name? That sound like Kevin that Cooper. Guy. Hold on, but see, that's the thing. Why does it sound? Why does that sound made up? Because Kamala Harris' name is involved no, 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 no. as the one that locked him up. Them, them, them if it said, if it said Donald Trump was the state attorney, if it said Donald Trump was the state attorney, right, and he was falsely accused, they'd, they'd be eating that shit up. But because it's, it's good old uh, uh, Kamala, right? But, I, that, that sounds fake. Listen, listen. Ain't, ain't none of us. Not Trump. You just said he's in that box and there's nothing he can do to get out of that box. So that's not the benefit I, I, of the doubt. I, I, no, no, let me understand something. I got proof that he's a wicked man, bro. I got proof. That was just that proof that Kamala Harris is a wicked woman. Damn. Damn. One time. Well, that's that's heard, listen, listen, okay. listen. You 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 have completely discredited yourself, bro. No, I didn't. You have. You are. That was that was that was one time. Oh, well, you know that was just uh, okay. once. Okay, I just I said that and I, I was discredited up until yeah, then. Yeah, you, you just. Okay, I, well, I, I take that back. Back that from you. He went he went quickly from it only takes one time to 
That was only one no, okay, time. No, no, no. In a matter of seconds. <laughs> Hear what I'm saying? I said once I've done the research and I've proved it. Go uh, look into Kevin that's, Cooper. Now I got to look into it. No, you just said I oh, she only it. she only messed up one time. You know, and that, that was just one day. There's plenty of so-called black people that she's under. Hey, listen. And like you said, over over marijuana charges. You go around the city of Detroit right now. It's, it was, it was, it was the spits on then. every corner. It was illegal then. Why? Because the government didn't find a way to tax it. Yet. That's right. As soon as they, exactly. soon as they exactly. found a way to tax it, exactly. you drive up and down eight mile and tell me if it's not. Listen, you drive up and down eight mile and tell me if it's not a dispensary on this corner, a church on that one, a liquor store on this one, and a chicken spot on that one. Because you know that's what they think about. But you know something? Right, they right, think right, all right you now, is is a church right, going, right, uh-huh. liquor loving, right now, chicken right now. eating. Right now, green eating, that's why they think you are. Right now, and and, and with, with hot sauce, because don't forget, oh, don't forget, don't forget, Gretchen, she's invited to the cookout. Hillary was invited to the cookout, and Hillary coming to the cookout with the hot sauce in the purse. Because that's what, oh, and don't when Kamala pull up, you be, please believe she bringing Megan Thee Stallion and her friend Quavo. Let me, let me ask you to drop ass with Kamala. Yeah, and, and niggas just eat that shit up. Let me ask you something. Would you agree that we ourselves are doing a, a large, what am I trying to say? We ourselves, That's we're doing a lot of damage to ourselves. Uh-oh. Would you agree with that? Yeah. Would you agree with that? You know, Tom, I'm going to tell you one thing we suffer from. This is factual, bro. Oh, yeah. We suffer from an inability to effectively communicate with one another. That's the truth. You know why That's we can't communicate truth. with each other? Yeah, because you know something, because we've been taught. Somebody over here being a, a white, half-ass white Republican, somebody over here being this. Your, some, listen, if your mama ignorant, your daddy ignorant, your grandparents are ignorant, you got two ignorant aunties and an ignorant drunk <laughs> uncle, guess that, what? Damn, so, chances of you so Kamala, so, so Kamala Harris was just ignorant. destined to be ignorant. She's not ignorant. She is ignorant. I tell you what, if I'm going to believe in somebody, she got to at least look like me. But it. that's the everybody that's your skin folk ain't your kin folk. Uh, that's and right. This is why the Bible say this. I want to ask you this: Do you have siblings by any chance? Yeah, I got seven sisters. You got seven sisters. I got seven sisters. So y'all, was y'all, y'all was raised in the same house? We were raised in the same house. Do you have the same views and do you act just like them? I, you know, some I could get into. I'm just asking you. No, I'm just asking you that question. No, yes or no. no. So no. All, so so I got siblings too. But just because we were raised and we sat at the same dinner table. Doesn't mean we gonna have the same views. You know Doesn't why? mean we gonna be the same you people. Know, you know why? But we let ultimately me, got the same up, upbringing as the ignorant mama, I'm, I'm, the ignorant I'm, father, the ignorant auntie, the ignorant grandma, grandpa, so on and so forth. So we cannot take that label. You know what I mean? Just because that's how uh, uh, how somebody wants to uh, perceive us. Okay, you know no, let me let me let me say We gotta have, we gotta have that intellectual, like you were saying. That was a beautiful thing that you said, talking about that communication. Yeah, amongst each other, yeah. we can't do it. I agree with that. But we gotta have that communication to fill out fill that person out. You know what I'm saying? I mean, absolutely, absolutely. Now, now, now. Let me let me let me ask y'all something. In the Bible, in that Bible, it it says somewhere in there that you're not supposed to believe in astrology, right? Scorpios, Aries, what you call it, this and that and this and that and this and that, right? That's not true. That is true, bro. I could listen, listen. I could listen. So that you, is true, bro. So you crazy because you an asparagus? Because that's what astrology no, tells you. No, no, oh, I'm crazy because I'm, I'm, I'm crazy because I'm, I'm, I'm an asparagus. No, no, no. Uh, 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 <laughs> bro, uh, you don't, you don't believe in astrology. You don't, I mean, no, you don't. I mean, it's, it's, it's the truth. I tell you what, this is what the deal is, bro. How is it true? If I know what sign you are. When I walk up on you and say, for instance, you told me, yeah, man, my birthday is such, 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 such. I know what I'm dealing with. That's the truth. It's the truth, bro. I've been doing it all my life. I'm not compatible with certain women out here. This is the truth. That's the truth. You're not compatible with certain women out here. He's not compatible. We Israelite men. We listen, we Israelite men. Israelite men is compatible with them. They almost any woman. You know something? If I had the time, I can prove myself to you. If I had the time, I could it would be overtime. I could prove myself to you. If I knew your sign and her sign, I could tell you what y'all going through, bro. And you know, and no, no, it, you know the sign that you ain't gonna tell because guess what this Bible do tell me? There's there's four things King Solomon just didn't understand: the way of an eagle in the air, the way of a ship in the water, the way of a snake on a rock. 
And the fourth one he just couldn't wrap his mind around is what happens when you put a man and a woman in a room long enough. <laughs> and Solomon was the wise man that walked earth. He said, I don't get it. It's just something about, we're talking about truth. Chemistry. I'm, I'm, I'm it's just something about chemistry. Yeah, chemistry something about is, some chemistry about the way that a with, man and a woman's body reacts when no, you leave them around each other long enough. No, but some of them you can you can you can do that, and then the next day you don't want to be bothered with her. But then some of them you can do that, and you want to say you want to spend <laughs> much more time with her. On and on and on. That's the way it goes. <laughs> but there you go. You were talking about post nut clarity, but chemistry allowed that to happen hey. because listen. <laughs> When, right. a, when you put a man and a woman together, no, it's not. Yeah, it is. No, it's not. Yeah, it is, bro. You, listen, you're not going to tell me that this woman is crazy because of the day she was born. No, you won't. I'm, a, I'm <laughs> like this, man. I'll be having this talk. This is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 10, from the top. Bring it up. Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh. Which who speaketh? Which the Lord speaketh. No, just a man speaketh. Which the Lord speaketh okay. unto you, O house of Israel. Thus saith the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen, uh -huh. and be not dismayed at the signs of the heaven. Uh -huh. For the heaven then are dismayed at them. Thus saith the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven. For the heaven then are dismayed at them. The heathen are dismayed at them. Right? So, you, know what the, yeah, you know what the so stars you, were created so this for? Was, this was you give me, you give me Genesis saying. 1. You give me Genesis 1. That was supposedly addressing what I was talking about. Because the, star, because the stars have no jurisdiction over your oh, and temperament. Hold on, hold on. The let stars me, have let me, no let me, jurisdiction let me, over let me, how you act. Let me, let me, let let me, me show me. you what the stars are for. Give me that. Um, Everything serves a purpose, bro. The question is, do you know exactly. about it? Can I see the you know about it? The stars, let's, let's, the let's, stars let's, were the stars' purpose. The reason God created the stars let's, was to tell you what season you're let, in, let, let me, not to tell you why the you land with is crazy. Let me let me see what level. Only of the Lord can tell you. Let that. me see what level of consciousness right. you want. Understand something, bro? Do you realize you're God? Of no. course. Do you do you of, really of, realize you're God? Of course. You listen, know you listen, know who told me that. I'm be honest. You know you know what you know what you know what I figured that out. When you when you acknowledge it, walk, talk, and carry yourself as a God, and just you know what the gods don't do. You are. You know what the gods don't do. What's that? Ah uh, ah, she crazy because she in the spirit. Gets. That's right. I ain't know where you get that from. I ain't never seen nothing. That's that. astrology. No, uh -huh, uh -huh. she was born when the star was in Cancer, so no, she's no, no, crazy. No, 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 oh, no, she, she, she no, has a split no, personality because no, she's no, a Gemini. No, no, listen, no, bro. You got, you got, you got, you got people that listen, just got bro, different bro, bro, traits, man. This is the book of John, chapter ten, and verse thirty-four. Bring it up. Jesus answered them. Who answered? Jesus answered them. Uh -huh. Is it not written in your law? I said, ye are God. Right. So the book that you keep telling us to put off already told us this. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Good. There's wisdom in that book. Let me tell you something. When a man Do me a favor, left, man. Stop reaching your hand over the sign. Oh, my, my bad, bro. Yeah. When a man is left with common sense and wisdom, right? And guess what? You got everything you need to navigate your way through life until death. And again, the wisdom and the knowledge comes from the laws of God, okay. which are found in, this, in the first five books of this great book that we have called the Bible. Right? So that the wisdom... <laughs> In which we need to live by the wisdom in which we need to be guided by. Matter of fact, you give me uh that Deuteronomy four, you hold your precept and give me uh Proverbs six. Six and twenty-four. Right? Because you said something, right? The wisdom needs to guide you in your life, right? The Bible tells you that the law, right? Do what he's gonna read. Proverbs six. Want some? <laughs> want some? Anybody want some? Are we doing king? No, you're not a king. I'm a god. You're a king too. We're a nation of kings right. and priests. King slash God slash king. Only for those that know it, though. Oh, my God. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 4, 4 and verse 5. Bring it up. Behold, I have taught you statutes and judgments. Even as the Lord my God commanded me, uh -huh. that ye should go, that ye should do so in the land where ye go to possess it. So it said, the Lord, talking about the law, statutes, and commandments of God. Right? Keep therefore and do them, uh -huh. for this is your wisdom 
and your understanding. So the law is wisdom. The law is understanding. That's why you have to keep them and do them. Read all. In the sight of the nations, uh -huh. which, ye, which shall hear all these statutes and say, Surely this great nation is a wise and understanding people. So when we keep in the law, statutes, and commandments collectively as a people, instead of just having a personal relationship with just every man for himself, so that makes the other nations respect us and say, who is these niggas with laws and they just this wise? It's, it's, it's wisdom not to eat pork. It's wisdom not to eat things that's gonna mess your body up, right? So the, the, law, the law is wisdom, right? Go ahead. You say this should, the wisdom needs to guide you, go ahead. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 6, verse 23. Bring it out. For the commandment is a lamp, and the law is light, and reproofs of instruction are the way of life. So when you got people that's walking in darkness, it's dark, you can't see where you're going, you need that light to guide you so you know where you're going. That's the role that the law plays in our life. It guides us through darkness. It's the wisdom that guides us in our life. And that's what black, Hispanics, Native Americans as a collective need in their lives is the laws of God. You know everybody don't possess that common sense and wisdom? Because common sense ain't common. And it's not because of the day they was born either. Hey, no, that, that ain't got nothing to do with it. It's got, a, it's got a lot to do. It's got something to do with who you were around since the day you were born. I mean, because you got people that do this coming from all walks of life. You got people that was in the streets. You got people that grew up in the suburbs. You got a bunch at, of different at, walks at, of life. At any given time, I can prove to you, i tell you what, there's some women out here, within three minutes of talking to them, I can tell you what time they are. Hey, listen, you should been out at y'all, man. It was a pleasure, man. Here, listen, so listen, you cannot go through life talking about these zodiac signs, bro. <laughs> listen, zodiac signs is I, Greek. Listen, know, bro, somebody give me that in the book of the Maccabees. Bro, I'm not, I'm not Second book, Maccabees 4. Right. Leave those Greek. I said, God, I'm not going to lie to you. 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 I'm not going to l